So you can see now how the beavers have basically expanded the pond edge from here to here. And they've built a little dam to contain the water there, which I hope they continue to do. We've asked them nicely if they could prevent the water from going down in this direction because that's where many of our seaberry plants are. That plant there is a mulberry and we have a lot of very beautiful nut pines. They've already done away with this plum tree here for reasons involving, I think, the root system because clearly they haven't taken it as food. Uh, but they seem to have deliberately expanded the pond. I'm standing on the new edge here from where the cattails are and they've expanded it all this direction. And we are going to work with them and plant in the springtime wapato in, which is a, uh, a wetland plant. It grows edible tubers. Some people call it duck potato. Uh, we're gonna plant it all throughout these shallower areas and we've just planted wild rice along this edge where there's a lot of water flow and water movement coming into that area. There's wild rice lacks movement. We're also in a very windy site, so we're gonna try planting some wild rice in and throughout here since it's such a nice and very accessible spot. We'll use our canoe over there to harvest it when and if it grows. So this is an exciting time for us.